in the stories that you tell us about Kartike and the elephant god or what is depicted in the dance, um, what is the spiritual uh, message or should we just hear it as a story or is something deeper? When Parvati, I'm telling you another story. When Parvati asked uh, Shiva, <clears throat> of uh, the spiritual significance of many of his actions, I can understand this, you're meditating, I can understand, okay, that is a spiritual thing. But now you're dancing, now you're hunting, now you're drinking, now you're smoking. What is the spiritual significance of all this? And you have all kinds of distorted and demented beings around you. What is the spiritual significance of all these people? I don't see any spirituality in them. Why do you have them around you? So Shiva said, <clears throat> there is nothing in the existence which is not spiritual. Everything is spiritual, unrealized. Now, all the methods that we're talking about, whether it is a story or a joke or a meditation or a process that we're doing, it is just to bring it into your awareness. What is it that you're clinging to? What is it that you have to what is it that's obstructing you? You just have to look at those things. Don't try to understand where to go. You don't know where to go. What is it that is stopping you? You just have to understand the obstacles. Don't try to understand the root of life. Because it's not a dimension to be understood. But you can become that.